This is a baseball made of tungsten, one of the heaviest metals there is. Holy moly. And this is a bat made of balsa wood, the lightest wood there is. We made both of these using our superior machine skills so we could see what happens when you use them against each other. Here's a hint. Step one is to get the tungsten down to baseball size. Luckily, tungsten is very brittle. Bro, I'll tell you what. After that, those bite-sized pieces were looking rather tantalizing. Once we got tired of waiting for our $500 hot plate to get hot enough to melt the bismuth, we remembered we have a kiln. Give it like a smack. Like hold it in your hands and keep holding it as you hit it against the ground. If I could just... Wow, Mitchell, you are a genius. Give the old tappa tappa. Over. You better be quick here, brother. One hand in it. Right. We got the carbide bits. We're gonna fill in the gaps here with the melted bismuth. Yeah, just just set the flaming bismuth slag on a nice table. Hey, this is steel table. Here it goes. Fill in those gaps. Oh yeah, baby. Ooh, that should be on. Satisfying video compilation. Let it settle. Let it soak in. Yeah. Wow, that was uh, enough. Bloop, 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 bloop. We're running out of bismuth here. It's already <laughs> surface tension. Science rules. Tomorrow. Round two. Point. All that threading the needle and detangling really got me tuckered out, so I decided to reward myself with a hot and spicy McChicken. So this big boy is clocking in right about five pounds. That's 16 times heavier than a normal baseball.
broke it, like hollowed itself out a little bit. Someone's gonna really like that method. <laughs> I did it for whoever that person was. <laughs> and then we remembered we're in a machine shop. I'm not loving what you did here. <laughs> that looks terrible. <laughs> it's just surfaced off the top. No, no. Damn it, no. <laughs> Trying to fix your mistake. Isn't that fragile? Yeah. Mm -hmm. There you go. Ooh, that's, that's what it's supposed to look like. Beautiful. That's what I was going for. I didn't <laughs> sanded it yet. You weren't even close. I hadn't hand sanded yet. <laughs> hand -sanded yet. The handle here is a little thin, uh, so we strengthened it by putting mahogany stain on it, since mahogany is a much stronger wood than balsa. And now it smells, smells of rich, rich mahogany. mahogany. So this weighs in at about 4.8 ounces. That is very light. Yep. Time to go hit it. If you pay close attention, you'll see that the ball's trajectory didn't change even in the slightest. Got us done that. Um, I think there's something wrong with the ball. Yeah. It broke our bat. It broke our bat. Oh my gosh, why is it so heavy? <laughs> Could I see a hat wobble? Yes. <laughs>